Let's get started by becoming familiar with the new ribbon interface in Microsoft Project 2010. Much like toolbars in previous versions of Microsoft Project, you see that the ribbon is essentially made up of, of commands. You'll navigate to the different areas of the ribbon by simply clicking on the upper portion of the tabs. You'll see that there's a task, resource, project and view tab up at the top of the ribbon once you get inside a particular area of interest you will see that there are various buttons you'll see that there are split buttons like the Gantt chart view that has a drop down you'll see that there are the uh, familiar commands that contain items like combo boxes where you can either enter in values or choose from drop downs. What you will also find in the upper left hand corner is the backstage. When this is clicked on it takes up the entire screen. This is much like the file menu item in previous versions and you will choose from the various options here and then you'll notice that you have a close, uh, the ability to close or hit OK and cancel here and this is a toggle you can toggle back and forth in the backstage what you'll also notice down in the lower portion of the application window is a status area that tells you a little bit more about the in this case the the task and what mode it's in whether it's manual or automatic this is also another way in which you can jump to the different views Team Planner, for example, back into task usage and then back to the Gantt chart. There's also a zoom slider down in the lower right hand side, which is nice. What you also have is the quick access toolbar, which is in the upper portion of the application window, which allows you to add commands to the quick access toolbar for frequently used commands that does not rely on the state of the ribbon. So as I add commands here, it doesn't matter where I go. If I jump into a different view, for example, it doesn't change what's happening in the quick access toolbar. The other thing to be aware of is using the Alt key is a quick way to navigate around via the keyboard. And when I hit the Alt when I'm in this particular window for example it brings up various letters here that allow me to quickly access certain areas of the application window in this case I hit K you notice how it quickly jumped me to that particular area and then if I hit G it brings me back to where I was before and allows me to jump back to a particular area so a lot of new functionality um, in the ribbon and uh, I hope you enjoy it and we'll see you again for the next uh, the next learning module.